And welcome back guys, JVids here. Today's video we're going to go over a super easy uh, collectibles and diggables and bottle tarot card uh, items uh, respawn glitch. Super easy. Uh, it's not new by any means. It's been around for a while, but it is still indeed working very well. Uh, so once we collect everything here, there's a tarot card upstairs. You can, don't have to do this in this location, but I'm currently just trying to get the gold watch right now. So this is why I'm doing the respawn glitch so I don't have to run all over the place to get the gold watch. I actually did realize that I have all five, that's why it wasn't giving it to me, uh, but I kept doing this anyways and collected a whole bunch of jewelry and a tarot card at the same time. But you can do this anywhere around the map with tarot cards, bottles, or collectibles, um, or anything that uh, is like jewelry, so to speak. So once we're going to do, we're going to double tap that home button, disconnect ourselves from the internet by going to the network settings, clicking on the box and clicking on it once again. Then we double tap that home button, bring us back into the game, go into free roam. Once free roam fully loads up, that's the only downfall to this method is you do have to wait through the uh, loading screen. Sometimes you do get infinite loading screens, but I actually haven't had any bad luck doing this so far. So once it all loads up, run back into the house or wherever you're collecting. Does not need to be at this location grab whichever you're grabbing again. I'm going to go ahead and grab this again. I have all five so that's why it wasn't giving me the gold watch but this is a good spot for the gold watch if you're looking for that collector set. We're going to go upstairs and grab that tarot card as well and then I'll show you guys uh, what I have in my satchel and I'll do it one more time just to kind of show you uh, the numbers and that it is actually uh, staying in my inventory. So we have four of the tarot cards, which is going to be the easier one to remember. Uh, and then we have a bunch of other little things here, so if you guys can take note of what I have. Obviously I got the five of the gold, so I can't get any more of that. And that's what I was here for. So what we're going to head, go ahead and double tap, that home, or, uh, double tap the home button once again. Then we're going to go to network settings. Uh, it's best to be over that anyways, because it's just going to bring you right to that network settings. You're going to tap that button, click the box, and click it once more. Double tap that home button to bring us back into the game, and then go to free roam. Once free roam loads up, simply run back to wherever you were collecting, um, whichever area. Again, it is a good idea to stay in that area for a little while prior to doing this. Uh, so that way you do actually respawn in that same area that you were in and the stuff that you were trying to collect or collecting is still in that area for you. So we're going to go ahead and grab it from the cabinet once again. And I was uh, getting really frustrated it wasn't giving me the gold watch but I have all five so I don't need to worry about that anymore. And then we'll go ahead and collect that tarot card upstairs as well. And then I'll show you on the satchel my numbers once again. And just to show you guys that it is actually working quite well. And they do stay in, in your inventory. Um, but I hope this uh, helped you out at all, guys. If it did, make sure you share the video and subscribe for uh, later content, of course. And as you see, we're at the five tarot cards there. And we do have more of uh, the necklace there. That was only a single one. But anyways, guys, I will, uh, I'm will. i just going to keep doing this for a little bit until I pretty much max all my stuff out. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If it did help you out at all, make sure you share, like, and subscribe. And I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.